okay you've got a receipt from a very generous customer because they've paid you before you've issued their sales invoice so how do you deal with that in zero let me show you okay from the dashboard we're going to head to our bank reconciliation and this time we are interested in a receipt on the 4th of January for £600 from Plenty Cash. Now what Zero's done is Zero has tried to match it. If we're alert, we will realise that this match is incorrect. It's not a receipt from ABC and it's certainly not for an invoice that's dated March 2016. We do a bit of investigation and we realise that this Plenty Cash is a payment in advance. This company clearly has Plenty Cash so they've paid us before we've actually issued our invoice. So what we need to do, we need to ignore this green and we need to select Create because we need to create a transaction in Zero relating to this. When we select Create, it gives us a small screen to input information. We want to go to Add Details, which just takes us to a bigger screen with more information on it. Cash is received. What is it received as? It defaults to a direct payment. We want to click on that drop down because we need to tell Zero that this is an overpayment, a payment in advance. Who's it from? It's from these guys who I think are going to be our new friends. Plenty cash. The date is correct. Description, we could add advance payment in here. The amount is fine. We will see that it's coded to accounts receivable and that is the correct place for it to go. It's against our customer listing. We then say save transaction. Now you'll just notice Zero is not happy here because it had chosen ABC electrical. We need to untick that. Zero was just trying to be too smart. So now we've got the correct transaction only. We click on reconcile or we could go up and say OK. That's the transaction dealt with. I'm just going to look at reports, aged receivables. And what we will see when we scroll down and if we look carefully, we will find plenty cash as a minus 600 balance. Now I'm going to show you what happens once we actually invoice Plenty Cash. So plus, create a sales invoice. Okay, so here we have our sales invoice created for, to Plenty Cash. We go to the green and we say approve. And when we do that, Zero gives us a notification. Plenty Cash has £600 in outstanding credit because they have paid in advance. Would you like to allocate credit to this invoice? And we choose Allocate. Now we can see that the overpayment is £600 and Zero asks how much we want to credit. The overpayment could have been more than this invoice, but the two match. So we're crediting £600 and then we select Allocate Credit. So now there you can see the sales invoice is for £600. There's an overpayment, i.e. a payment in advance matched against it and the amount due is zero. That's how we deal with a customer making a payment in advance of a sales invoice being issued. As always, if you like my videos, please let me know that you like them. And why don't you subscribe to the channel so you get notified when new videos are uploaded each week. Until next time, happy zeroing.